All right, hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome to Dungeon Death Ball. It is a... I'm really liking this this low-poly, super low-poly uh, tex, uh, pixel textured dungeon. I don't know, I've, I've gotten into 3D modeling lately, and seeing stuff like this looks really cool to me. Anyway, I'd uh, say it's like dodgeball football. I think it's more football. It's like football, but it's a dungeon crawler roguelike. I don't know how to describe it beyond that, because I haven't played it yet. Now let's just dive right in. Face 12 brutal matches of death ball. Survive to win back your team's freedom. Fail and they die. Perfect. Ah, oh, I need to make more things that look like this. I know there's a number of people that absolutely despise this visual style, but for me it's so good. Team Hodgepodge. Dario. Carrier. Uh, let's see. Oh, interesting. Easy. Using this ball makes it easier to win, but your final stage score will be lower. Cheese. <laughs> Cheese ball. Ah, uh, reduce damage from shots. Plus one damage on shots. Honestly, I'm just gonna start with the Razor. It's only a 5% damage reduction, and I don't fully know what I'm doing. Swap which player will start with the ball. Swap positions. Team info. Okay. Perk, lock, carrier. So it does look like they have randomized stats. Damage is different. Cool. Disord uh, so we're a disorganized assortment of strangers thrown together in a state of panic. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, this music. Okay, so I'm going to have to get the ball. But that's fine. I can punch the rock. Or I can punch the creature. Which kills it. Perfect. Okay, so, rest. Oh. Other players are alive with AP remaining. They can still act. Okay. Grab that. I'm gonna move down. Now this plant has three. How much damage can this guy do with an attack? Or, I guess we gotta rest. Looks like we get really tired. Okay. Because I can do that, then go here, and I'm just gonna have him rest. And then move down. Okay, so he is completely out of juice. Uh-oh. Um... If I have him rest... Okay, no! There we go. Okay. I am a lucky duck. Now, if this guy attacks the ball, he has the ball now. That is a concern. Okay. I'm gonna have them both rest, because we can't do anything. I am learning how to play in the worst possible way. Okay, I'm just gonna have him rest. Now, is this guy gonna chuck ball? No. He grabbed gem. Okay. So I'm gonna punch that guy, and then we're gonna move out of the way. And then we're going to have Dario rest. Alright. Oh, we're running out of time. I have stamina to actually hit the guy. Okay. Well, this isn't working. I know there's like a par time and I'm losing it a little bit. Okay. Wait, I made it. Oh, I didn't need the ball. Oh, but I don't didn't get the touchdown. Got it. Learning. See, it's fine. All right, let's see what we got. Increase. Oh, so we can spend money on leveling them up, but we got nothing. 
I'm learning. It makes sense. Oh, there's my friends. They're doing better than I. Alright, let's take a look at this. So, titanium push distance on... on shots reduced on... I don't know. I'm just gonna go standard. The razor ball seems really useful. Okay, it is stunned. Ooh. That's a bit of a stamina cost. Okay, so we've got that trap there. I'm not fully certain what the trap does. Okay. Then I gotta rest and get out of the way. I'm just gonna have both of them rest. I don't think I'm gonna pull this one off. So, one thing I'm noticing is that we can potentially have... Okay, so I have a limited amount of time. Don't really want to do that. There's also the rock that could be broken, but we don't do a whole lot of damage. And I don't have enough. I don't know. Now, is there a way that I can... I can punch this guy back. Can't do too much else. Okay, we move him. He's tired. Hopefully we don't get cornered. We might. Does this plant creature kill the dude? Kind of, yes. Now, does this thing... How much HP does this thing have? Okay. So far, so good. I think we're good. I want those gems, but I don't think I'm going to be able to get it as I currently am. So I'm just going to rest. Okay. I should be able to do this. I really wish I could do is slam one of these guys over. Right, let's see if I get unlucky. I think I'll be fine. At the very least, we can get a touchdown. Alright, so we get some gems. He's gonna rest for one, and then we're gonna touch down. Perfect. Yeah, we didn't get the other gems, but it's fine. Much better. A lot more gold. Learning and improving. Perk knockback, perk backspin. Ball rebounds, plus one tile after impact. Useful. The extra strength would be kind of nice. Knockback, pushes enemies back. Um... I don't know. I'm thinking one in backspin, one in stamina for both of them. There we go. Let's keep going. I appreciate the fact that you can save and quit. I, I guess these stages do get a little long, so I can see why. Alright. Uh, they're getting longer. Flash. Easier to win, but your stage score will be lower. Extra st stun duration. Eh, no. Do we pass? If I hit him with that... It'll knock him back. Okay. 
I think that's fine. I like the backspin bonus. I'm gonna grab the money before it becomes problematic. Alright, there we go. So what I want to do is maybe knock enemies into other enemies. We gotta clear a path. There's too many enemies, is the real answer. Now, do we just pick the ball back up? Yes. Okay, the only problem is my people are very tired. But at least... Oh, do we get a gem for that? Or was that gem already there? I am unsure. Let's see. I'm just going to rest twice. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to make par. At least not today. Okay, do we have anything? I'm gonna shoot that guy. And then we're gonna move forward. Honestly, I guess this guy's gonna start punching Rock. I'll just have him rest instead. Okay, there we go. Punch him over. rest. We're gonna punch these guys. There we go. Alright, that should work. That uh, didn't quite work. Okay, too tired. I'll have to wait. Because yeah, I know the plants will just kind of eat. They're more like hazards, I think. gonna rest and I'm just gonna punch that thing and then I'm gonna be tired and then I'm gonna have him rest twice because there's nothing else I can do I could punch this guy and I'm just gonna do that here's a problem this guy's in my way but I can stun him and that works out for me Okay, I'll just have him rest. I don't know what else I'm going to do. Luckily, it seems like most of the monsters are, I'm not going to say kind of pushovers. Yeah, da attacks adjacent tiles. His plan is to wait, so maybe I'm okay. I'm just going to punch it for the time being. Uh, let me think. Because I'm going to have to contend with that guy. So I'm going to rest. And I'm going to punch him. I'm going to have him go over. It probably doesn't help me too much, but if I can punch this plant down... See if this guy moves forward or if he just attacks. Oh, less perfect. Okay. I think I'm just gonna shoot this guy. Yeah, we're not gonna hit the par. Too many enemies. I'm not strong enough for this. He's out of juice. Really hoping one of these guys would move forward, but I guess the the plants don't attack the monsters historically. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna just move up here and rest. There's not much I can do about it. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm pretty stuck here. Okay. If I shoot this guy, it stuns him. And I can just keep punching this guy. I really need to up my melee damage. I 
Now, I could punch him, but no, I think we need to rest and be ready. Oh, boy. How much HP does he have? Okay, let's have him rest. I'm gonna punch that guy, but there's nothing I can do. Unless... What if I rest? And I punch the plant. Better. Okay. So far, so good. Kind of. Rest. Punch. We have aggrieved. And do I have enough? Yes. I do. Okay, the big question is, no, they're not going to move in my way. They're going to want to move in my way, but they're not going to be able to. All right, we got it. We got every gem, and I don't know. It worked out. Okay. So I'm going to give him the extra strength. We need a killer. The skull keys to unlock new teams. Oh, cool. Okay, I'm just gonna keep rolling. Is this? Uh -oh. This seems concerning. All right, let's see how we do. I'm pretty much stuck with these guys. Let's see, extra rebound on shot impact. I think we're fine. I really gotta remember to pass here. That's exactly what I was looking for. Okay. Trap kills the di uh trap kills the dinosaur. All right, killer. Do your thing. The coppers are a little worrying. Let's just get the gem, and then rest, because I'm probably going to need to do some other stuff. Yes, yeah, so you can't back away from the coppers. Understandable. Now, do I just punch him? Yeah, I'm just going to go for the kill. Okay, so far so good. So I'm going to have to have him rest. Now, I could shoot him. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Kappa's right there. Easy peasy. Now, I only have so much energy. I can punch him, but then I can't move. So let's just rest. Because i got to be ready to move a little bit, but also kill. Okay, so do I do... Do I do a shoot? I think we, we should rest. I could rest twice, or we could move up one. There we go. Now, I think what I might want to do... Punch him backwards. Yeah, we've still got plenty of stamina. Then move forward. I'm going to have him rest. Be ready to go. Because we're going to have to clobber knot a couple of people just for a brief second here. Let's see. If I shoot, it stuns him. And then I punch him. Death! Now let's have him rest. The other cop, but yeah, that extra, that extra damage, going, damage is going a long way. I can take. We're not going to get the gem, but we get par. Unless we don't get par. Nope, within par. Perfect. Yeah, there's a bonus for below par, but eh. Okay. So another point in backspin wouldn't be the worst idea. Yeah, let's do that. Because if I do backspin, that means he can more or less just 
huck the ball out a bunch of times and just whammo an enemy into submission. It's a little stamina intensive. Hollow ball. Reduce stamina penalty when health. Uh, no, I don't care. Hmm. This one's tougher. Here we kind of go. Kind of messy. Not exactly what I intended for. Okay, so if I shoot him. And then I rest. And then I pretty much can't do anything with this guy. Which is tragic. I could take the ball, but I don't think it's going to work out for me. This kind of reminds me of, uh, and this is going to be a bit of a hot take, this reminds me of Fidel Dungeon Rescue. Okay, let's undo that. I'm going to punch him. And we're going to rest. Because the raptor is going to hit that guy. Stuns him, does a lot of damage. Perfect. Okay, what do we got? Punch him. Okay, do we hit him backwards? Unfortunately, this doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Otherwise, I could move down and knock the raptor over. I'm just gonna probably have both of them rest. Feels like I'm going to have to do some things on the next round and I want to be ready for it. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to move him forward. We're going to pass the ball and have him shoot. Okay. Hazards go. Tough enemies exist. Gonna have him rest. Now, this guy's got a full docket. I'm gonna take, and if I do shoot, it stuns him. Perfect. And we solve the ball back. We're out of stamina, but it's fine. This is, uh... Of a lineup here. Pass and shoot. Alright, there we go. And can I hit him? No, but we gotta rest. There we go. Stamina's good. Unfortunately, killing our way through all of these guys is gonna take some serious doing. Um, okay, so let's pass and punch and we're going to shoot we're just I'm just a grieving my way through this because unfortunately I'm a little stuck I guess I could go around I'm gonna rest I'm just gonna punch this guy yeah I'm just gonna go around because nobody's going to be able to block his passage. No, they are. Because you know what? Like a fool, I have no stamina. So instead, I'm going to rest. And I'm going to just kill. And then I'm just going to rest. Unfortunately... Uh, yeah, they move my way. Shoot. 
Uh, let's undo. How much stamina do you have? Not enough. Okay, so we're just gonna pass. Because Dar Dario has enough stamina to pass over. Alright, we're good. I was really hoping he'd jump onto the trap and kill himself. Oh, well. Get it, Dario. We're good. Alright, so we don't quite get it, but we get every gem. Which more or less covers the loss. Okay, I got a hundred and... Ugh. Oh, that's just enemies with an uh, a tile with all attacks. Okay, that's useful. I'm gonna give Russell the extra stamina. Now let's keep going. I think I can swing one more. Ow. Maybe? Maybe one more. I could do the whole run. But I think I've got a very good idea of what this is. I wish there were some more, like, interesting perks and pickups. Swap ball. Do we swap positions? Yeah? No. And spike ball. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna lose the... I'm going to lose out a little bit here in order to kill. There we go. Now let's just have him rest. I'm really digging the music on this. It is proper bloopy. Like, very VVVV. Which I'm super appreciating. Let's see. I'm just gonna rest. Alright. Wow. He really is just a bruiser now. I love it. I'm curious about, uh... I, oh, I know there's character perks and stuff. Like, unfortunately, I think we're playing kind of the, the not-great version of this. Okay, so I'm just gonna have him go there. I'm not gonna be able to hit both. So in that case, I'm gonna bring him down. We might actually punch rock. <laughs> but having both of these characters next to each other seems far more useful. Okay. I'm gonna move here. I will punch him. Because, to some degree, I feel like my somewhat full lethal play playthrough, playstyle, works better for me. The less enemies there are, the better. That Cyclops is legitimately a li little concerning. Little concerning. Okay. Let's see. You can just kill him, yeah? Perfect. Let's keep resting. Because the Cyclops looks big. But how big? Oh, he big. If I do this, he cannot be moved. But what about him? He can. Shoot. Yeah, because I can, I can push him back, which is good. Is there a better way to do this? Take ball, shoot ball. At the very least, stun. Okay. Respect this might not work out the way I want it to. Alternatively, we can just punch him a couple of times. Okay, I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna take the ball. But Dario, kind of not, because yeah, we've got. We got biggins here. Here's the thing, though. I can stun biggins with ball. Okay. I'm preemptively just gonna rest. Because I think we're gonna need it. This is... Dicey, but not that dicey. Punch him. 
rest again. And then we're going to rest again. Okay. That stun lasted a lot longer than I thought it was going to. Here's my logic. Slam and jam him into next Tuesday. Oh. He didn't like that one. I remove him back. Uh, and I'm going to destroy the rock. There. Now I got some more room to maneuver. Oh, well, that worked out. And here is the money question. Can't do that. Could punch him. Could shoot this guy. There we go. And he doesn't have enough stamina. I'm just going to rest twice. This is a little dicey. I don't like this position because I think Krombus is going to pop up. Okay, so he's doing a charge. And we're out of juice. Oh. I might have screwed myself over. Because I don't know if I'm going to be able to survive this one. I should not have moved forward. Because I wanted this guy to move down, but I can't do it. My best bet... Oh, I've got... I've got two. Alright, there we go. I'm just going to have him rest. And we're just going to see what happens. Okay. We live, we're not going to hit par. But I wasn't really expecting to hit par today anyway. This is still kind of the tutorial. Oh, and this actually works out. More or less. Because here's the thing. I can punch this guy. Get him on the trap. Now we maybe don't have to worry about him. I'm going to have him rest and just kill this guy. There we go. Thank you, Hazards. Okay, we're, we're out of par, which honestly is actually kind of freeing in its own way. And there's only so many enemies left, so I can just... I can just kill. Okay. Now we just gotta clear away so I can get that gem. Okay, I'm gonna just rest twice. Okay, they move forward. It fine. Now, I'm going to have to have him move forward and rest. I guess I might as well hit one of these guys. I'll hit him. Now, let's go up. This guy's a bit of a concern, I think. I'm not actually sure if he's moving into that slot. I should have just moved out of the way. Ah, he did. Alright, he dead. And I could hit that guy, but there's no point in it. Right, let's rest. I think we're good. All Russell has to do is just rest and then grab the gem. Alright, so far so good. Oops. Get back there. Enjoy the lightning, sucker. We rest. And we got it. Goal. Trial and error. Good enough. There we go. I'm glad we grabbed the spike ball. I think we would have had trouble otherwise. Uh, gosh, more points in knockback it has some serious potential here. I think I'm going to do that. And skull keys to unlock new teams. Cool. And we're at the midway point. Let's even quit. Let's see. Um, let's see if I can unlock anything new. Daily challenge mode is available, and some other things. Okay, if I do a new game, I don't know. Because I wanted to, I want to potentially unlock some new teams and mess around with them, but I'm not entirely sure how to do it. I don't necessarily want to sacrifice the current guys, but I think I'm just going to abandon them and double check. Select team. Ah, here we go. 
Hey, I got four. So I could potentially get the warriors who have a brawler with knockback and KO. Attacks stun or knockback. Bolt bolters. Attacks charge in a straight line. Cost plus one stamina per tile. Power nap. Recover more stamina when resting. Hmm. Hammers. Backspin, which I like. And brawler. Attacks pierce through a row of tiles. Attacking costs extra stamina. Hmm. Yeah, because hodgepodge is not great. Oh, but it says they have a random perk. That's interesting. It looks like, actually, to some degree, I, I don't want to give up on these guys initially, because each team can unlock X number of, of keys and stages complete. I, I just want to look at the rest of these. So, Energize. Automatically recovers some stamina every turn. Oh, that's really good. Pair of Specialized, uh, pair of specialized in Traversing the Field, but I got to walk 500 tiles to unlock them. So, use less stamina when performing actions, and take no damage from spike traps. Useful. Haymakers. So, just attacks deal more damage. Is the Haymaker perk to make up for their lack of fighting prowess. Huh. Wait, Naymakers, not Haymakers. Displacer. Powerball. Ball shots push opponents further, and attacks push enemies further. Bruise Ball. Ball shots do more damage. Attacks do more damage. Deal a lot of damage, but get worn out quickly. Oh, strength plus one. All stamina costs increased by one. That's rough. So pacifists cannot attack and have extra max stamina. That's rough. I feel like you should still be able to attack. The It just doesn't do any damage. You're just pushing. Let's see. Plenty of stamina, but they rarely find gold. So the streamliners, the lightweights, automatically recover stamina every turn, but less less strength. I'll leave the game without purchasing any strength upgrades. Ugh. And slammers. No points for finishing in par. Double points for touchdowns. Makes sense. All right. Dungeon Death Ball is really cute. It's much more like tactical puzzle than I was expecting. I was kind of expecting to pick up like random upgrades or something. That would change how you play. I think to some degree I would love to see that as part of this. But at the same time I think this works perfectly well as like a turn-based tactical game. That's really just a puzzle game pretending to be a strategy game. And I think there's actually a market for that for a lot of people. That it's much more cerebral as opposed to he he. You know I, I gave this character big gun. Or uh, grinded this character up to the, become obscene. So I don't have to worry about strategy anymore. For me, I don't know. It's great across the board. It looks like you can also have much larger teams. Like I'm wondering if the uh, trial run that I'm currently doing uh, really is kind of limited to such a small group and such a limited amount of abilities because I'm supposed to be learning the ropes without actually you know, having any chance of victory-ish. I don't know. I, I guess I'd have to get further to figure out, but I am out of time. So if you guys like this video in any way, shape, or form, Leave me a like, helps more than you know, and if you want to see more, hit subscribe, because I've got tons of rad new indie games to check out every single day, and I hope they're all as good as this one was. But with that, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.